その薬ケツに刃ぶち込んで殺すぞ Try it! Oh shit, they hurt you. <laughs> Yo, what's up, guys? How's it going? I'm Frank Tesloff. And welcome to Attack on Titan. So, what has happened in the last episode? Absolutely fucking nothing. <laughs> I'm just I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Shit has happened. Listen, in retrospect, my nitpicking was probably just because I was pissed that it didn't progress fast enough. But it was 20 minutes. What can you ask from 20 minutes? I like, honestly not much can happen in 20 minutes. So looking back, as I was editing the previous reaction, it was a bit nitpicky. Yeah, I, I yeah, it was. <laughs> but just to be sure, some shit actually happens this time. I have summoned the one punch man. And hoodie for this one to channel the power of anime and bring a good episode not saying the last one was bad it was just a tad bit slower than everything else but because everything else was so fucking fast it was so good of course it wasn't on par even though it was really good you know what i'm trying to say anyways without much else babbling let's get right into attack on titan episode 13. Two we are, by the way, over halfway of the season. That's very cool. Recap, yeah, baby. But honestly, though, I'll, I'm I'm editing the previous episode right now, and there's just so much nitpicking about like nothing happened, even though shit happened. Like, I'm sorry, I if I was dumb, but uh, stuff stuff happened in the episode. Of course, they're gonna use this scene again. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Jean. Man, don't kill him. Don't kill Jean. I actually grew to like Jean. Fuck. What powers here because he's so mad all the fucking time. Uh, ta, 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 ta. That's just classic Aaron Aaron. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. He will kill all the titans with his anger unbeaten. He will beat. As always, if you would like to see these two weeks prior, that is four full episodes. Early, damn man, that's that's a deal. That's a deal. No Patreon down below. Check it out. There's many other things, many other shits to do, to bonuses as well. And I'm about to watch four, four, probably with some whiskey soon, probably actually tomorrow. And that will be on Patreon probably a couple days earlier as well. So if you are interested in a, 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 this or four or She Hulk or Rick and Morty, Patreon down below. Thanks. Primal Desire, The Struggle for Trust, Part 9. He keeps going! Oh my god! <laughs> Alright, Jin. Jin, Jin, don't die, Jin. Jesus. Oh fuck. Please don't kill Jin. So, how smart are the Titans? Do, does, does, it, does it know he's in there? Or. Oh, what is her name? Rilo? Rilo, right? Yeah, they keep going through. That's the thing. Marco! Marco! Somebody's dying, I just know it. Okay, teamwork, teamwork. Oh. When you play with somebody else's settings, right? <laughs> what the fuck? He kicked it! Oh. Oh, 
むちゃしやがって来たこっちがしねえよあれを見てはいビケスはおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおエレンを扉まで援護すれば死してよエレンを扉まで守れ俺らに食いつかないんだ食いつかれるまで接近するしかないエレンを扉まで援護すればこっちをこらつかれとそのくせにケツに刃ぶち込んで殺すな Try it Oh shit, they hurt you. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh my god. That's a big baby. That's a big ass. That's big Aaron! <laughs> oh, they should look at him. He's semi conscious, okay. Jesus. Whoa! People dying. Hmm. Oh Jesus. Yeah. Crush him. What the fuck is that the uh, fucking Ice King from God of War? No, Game of Thrones? Was it Ice King? Oh, it's like a Frozen King, no? I don't know. It looks like him. Oh, they did it! They did it! Oh, fuck, man, I'm so happy. The last episode has been worth it. <laughs> <laughs> in that case 107 years ago um something happened with a big big fucker who with the attack on titan logo kind of looks like he's got a crown that's why i assume a king but yeah he's just bald he, he has no hair he, he he's just got a dome all right so what does it say history of the war with the titans part one according to the oldest existing records the titans emerged 107 years ago only subsequently most of mankind was eaten by the titans huh listen that's one thing i was wondering about i know in one of the first episodes they showed some place else and the place within the walls and i thought that someplace else outside of the maria Cena, you know the walls like there's more places than just that but after seeing the outside zoom out of the whole place and seeing the lands and shit like where pixies was the place where pixies was with the king that wasn't the king that was the some type of a lord but i assumed that was outside Side of everything but seeing how big the place is everything was inside right therefore is it true that everything we've seen so far is from inside of the walls like so far the mankind it seems like only survived in that within the walls like there's no other cities there's no other places as of now i mean maybe they'll show something later but as of now that's the only place right because i think i assumed wrong that there's other places but i don't think there are oh 
boy. Uh, buddy is about to be fucking eaten while his friend friends sets up can can cannons to shoot this motherfucker right up the bum, right up the rectum, right up the anus, just like that. Because that's their weak spot. They said it twice now. It's gonna be. It's not a joke. Probably. Maybe it is a joke. I don't know. <laughs> Mankind tried using cannons against the titans, but their durability and vitality overwhelmed all human combat techniques. Oh, so they just appeared all of a sudden and killed everybody except the people that managed to be quick enough with the walls and build like a whole ass. Or maybe they had the, had the walls prior and just for some reason and... Uh, you know, it came in handy that they had them when the titans appeared. Interesting. Definitely interesting. Okay, what now? The hall has been plugged. What are they gonna do with Eren? <laughs> He'll regrow, I think. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Armin! Oh. Is it the guy? Levy! Levy! Is Levy here? No? Yeah. That's Levy. Or Levi, I don't know how you mean. Yeah! <laughs> I was right. <laughs> They're pretty fucking cool. These guys. Oh, look, the river. The inside. They're making a jo good job of showing just how fucking many there are. It's like ants, just humongous. For tests? Yeah. Yeah, that's a predicament, isn't it? Like, are you gonna celebrate that you fucking finally did something? Or... You can, because so many people died, you just, just wanna mourn. Hey. Jean, you look cool. That mask. Gotta tell ya. Marco? Marco? Did we just lose Marco? Epidemic from what? From the dead bodies? Jesus, man. Where's his lips? What the fuck? Holy fucking fucking bullshit shit. Oh my god. That is disgusting. Just people, huh? Why is he in a cell? Fuck you guys. ちこ部隊のトップ。エルヴィン団長とリヴァイ兵長。リヴァイ。いや、私はそう。あの、リヴァイ。ノットレヴィ。マイバー。ここはどこですか今君の身柄は憲兵団が受け持っている。あ、I the木。志願しなくにある家が石の地下室。そこに巨人の謎がある。そうだね。はい。おそらく。They that's the theory. 
鍵なんだ俺は殺す。<笑> Yes! 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 Finally, not a fucking shitty ending. Fucking shitty cliffhanger. Yes! <laughs> Fuck yeah, man. Oh, that was great. Alright, folks, and there you have it. Attack on Titan Season 1, Episode 13. This one was so fucking good! <laughs> yes, man. Oh, I enjoyed this one so much. And I don't think it would have been necessarily possible without the last one. So, again, I apologize for the nitpicking in the last one. That was uh, not necessary. Anyways, here we are. This was so good. So many fucking uh, things. Just like, okay, right out of the bat, we got to know some more about the Titans, how they work. We now know that after they eat people they don't cook them inside well they i guess they somewhat do but then they don't have do they have well i mean they talk about stabbing them in the cheeks right between the cheeks but now they i think said they don't have asses so they just puke them out the people or rather they said they don't have digestive systems so it would make no sense for them to have asses right mm, that is a question for another day but we got to know they puke them out and they're just in this fucking ball of vomit, vomit these corpses one of the scouts is dead marco which is sad they didn't confirm it, but they somewhat confirmed it. Uh, they pretty much confirmed it. He had no lips. Am I wrong? I might have seen that wrong, but I think he had no lips. What's up with that? Yeah, and then the obvious, they plugged the hole. It was very epic, but now it's a weird situation where that is so interesting. They're tackling it in this way. Like, two over 200 people died, so you shouldn't really celebrate, but you won for the first time, so you maybe should celebrate. It's like, uh, what do you do, man? It's a weird state to be in, but still they didn't win and now with all the bodies they were talking about a pandemic possibly because of the bodies am, am i wrong with that then so many just dead bodies and vomit won't cause pandemic and that's why they had the masks as well to not get it i guess that people disease or titan vomit disease maybe which is a very interesting thing to just add in like they could have just uh, do it very simple you know titans eat people they vomit them out done or uh, even simpler they eat people they disappear done but the fact that they're trying to do it very realistically and they add just like dead people disease into it interesting man very interesting and I'm, I'm 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 wondering where they will go with that you know the show for what it is for the fact that there are humongous creatures human looking creatures that want to eat humans like as crazy as that sound the show is pretty grounded which always should be appreciated like it just if a show isn't grounded enough that and you just are not really relating as much to it and you are not invested as much as you should be because it just feels like something that wouldn't happen. Like, for example, in She-Hulk when the guy threw a middle finger in the courtroom. Like, that would never ever in a fucking fantasy happen. You cannot throw middle fingers in a courtroom. So for that, that wasn't really grounded. So it took me out. That's a good example. Fucking She-Hulk, man. I, I hope it'll, it'll get better. <laughs> but uh, we'll see. Anyways, he plugged the hole, the titans were following him, but it wasn't mindless following like I thought. Like, it wasn't just, you know, Eren is now a titan, so he's got this aura of all the other titans go to him. The scouts managed to scream at the titans like, hey, I'm gonna knife you in your buttocks. And the titans turned around. It wasn't a mindless following, which is the opposite of what I thought it may be. Jean didn't die thanks to his fucking amazing teammates, colleague. Let's go, everybody, every single one of them just saved his ass and they worked as a team finally well marco died but you know i didn't know much about him so it doesn't matter i'm glad you didn't die <laughs> Aaron seems to be semi to fully conscious while being the titan i guess as long as he's got the drive to kill all the titans like as long as he remembers then he is somewhat conscious which i'm guessing he will learn to control more and more as the time goes on so that's very cool and i was a little pissed that he ended up in jail at the end but it seems 
seems like they are trusting him. It was just a precaution. You know, they can't just have him out in the open. That would be risky. But in the end, Levi turned out to trust him. He recruited him, I guess, into his group. Very cool. They're they're like, they're so similar, not even look-wise, but you know, they have a lot, lot of similarities and I'm glad they're working together because Eren did seem to be getting a little cocky in the previous episode and the episode prior as well. So if Levi turns out to be his mentor in a way, that's, that's very cool. I hope that works out. He, Levi, definitely does not look like a guy you want to mess with. No, sir. You know what? I actually do have a minus about this episode. One fucking huge minus. No Sasha. Where's Sasha? Like, if they just wouldn't show her at all, I would be like, okay, she's doing something. But motherfuckers teased her for, I think, like one scene, one frame. That was it. We want more of Sasha. It's been too long. We need Sasha. Come on, man. All right. I think I went through most things. So let's go check Reddit. <laughs> Okay, there does not seem to be a discussion for this episode, which is kind of weird. There's a rewatch one, but of course I'm not going to be watching that, so interesting. Yeah, okay, well I guess no red in for this episode, unfortunately. <laughs> All right, and that has been Attack on Titan episode 13. No Reddit. Man, that sucks, but okay. I think the discussion afterwards was enough. There's a lot to talk about, and I think I talked about most. One thing I forgot, I just now realized, is the fact that they also have a plan now for... Like, they talked about in a cell with Aaron and Levi about going outside to the district that has been taken first. Shiga, Shiga something, Shiga Nasha... Eh, I'm not sure. Where his mom died, where his house is, and... Honestly, I'm glad they know about the key and all that. Although I don't know how how they found out, but they know. And it's not like, yeah, let's go retake the thing. But Aaron has a secret side quest where he's gonna go to his house and find out the secret. No, everybody knows about the house, about the secret. So that's where they are heading because they realize it is possibly a source of future help for the Titans, maybe. Fuck, what is he hiding? What is Aaron's dad hiding in that fucking basement? And also they have two Titans now chained up alive titans why experiments maybe will be interesting to see what they do with them but with that being said i think i went through most things if i forgot something or if i missed something in the show be sure to leave a comment below i appreciate those very much no matter what it is even the fucking spams about some mills in my neighborhood yay to those you fucking bots <laughs> and yeah if you like this episode leave a like below if you want to see more sub down below and if you want to see the next attack on titan or possibly even the four next attack on titans check out the patreon down below there are many more things other than two weeks early access i'm possibly thinking about doing patreon exclusive show i don't know yet what but with the fact that i can just upload a whole thing on patreon and not edit it and not spend all that fucking time editing a thing i'm thinking about doing something i don't know yet what but we'll see for now i'm still in the middle of catching up with the shows with the movies so that's a future talk but again if you do want to check it out and support me some there's a link down there in the description and with that being said, this has been Frank with Attack on Titan. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day. And I will be seeing you in the next one.